Hello everyone, uh, welcome to my channel Caterpillar John Hank. Today, uh, our topic for today is uh, regarding about the sensor of a Caterpillar Grader 14M. Okay, this Grader 14M is a steering problem. So, steering sensor, how you can identify or how, you, how do you know that the sensor of steering is damaged? Okay. Again, for all the subscriber uh, who so continuously uh, follow my video or uh, seeing my video, thank you very much. And also the newer, newer subscriber, thank you also for trusting me. So anything, uh, any problem that you have or uh, any problem that you are facing at this time, so don't hesitate to send me a message. So I'm happy to respond. Anything can help. Okay. Uh, this video is regarding about the sensor, how to check actual checking. Okay. Hello everyone. Now I'm here the the same as a 14M greeter. This is not the same as a, I was a solved the problem before. Few days ago or, or almost one week right now. So, but uh, I'm. Uh, I'm here it again. There is a 14M here now. As you can see. 14M. Okay. This grader is making me crazy to find it out. And then now it is good. And uh, because uh, this is steering sensor, it's already uh, it's available. So uh, I have a good opportunity to check actual okay you cannot check actually this sensor if you fix okay like for example if you fix it right the position uh, the connection of the socket like for example okay this socket as you can see you fix it uh, right and then try and testing you cannot access or you cannot do that process directly you know what I've seen some uh, way how to testing it what to do this is a piece of magnet okay piece of magnet this piece of magnet you will see after this okay for example now the staring in a, in a straight position staring is a is in a straight position okay now Uh, what to do this magnet if you measure the position of this sensor from the end or the bottom until the outer side okay that's that's the exact measurement okay so on the piston this piston inside of that piston they have a magnet to keep the sensor moving or sensing the magnet which direction to me they, that magnet is measuring the distance of the steering how much move how many percentage from the middle okay now in this way we're going actual uh, testing of the steering sensor okay I will show you so I will connect it properly on the sensor this is the wire see she, she can see the wire is connected to the main socket okay what I have done now I already put a marking the orange color the orange color is supply the same as the other side this is the 8 volt supply on the right steering they have an 8 volt supply okay 8 volt supply and the brown color it is a negative black from the sensor see this is the brown and then i will connect to the opposite side as a negative <coughs> oh, excuse me and then the white color <coughs> at the other side that is a signal 
so now I make the right position of the wiring as you can see yellow to the white okay and then orange to the orange and black to the black so now it's right now we will show I'm going to show you all in this video that sensor will not function unless that I've seen something on the mag magnet as you can see the error will still remain will not be removed even the sensor is connected see the error in the, the monitoring system it is showing a steering malfunction and right steering sensor above normal okay now I will show you something this a uh, simple techniques that you can possibly use okay now I will put this magnet okay just a second keep it hold I will not uh, shut it off okay as you can see the magnet is already attached uh, you see I'll, I'll try to touch the uh, steel and then it is uh, attracting uh, on the steel now it is in if you check the measurement between the the last and the bottom of the sensor is in the middle okay now we'll see it what happened after the same connection the same position the steering is in a straight position okay both sides because if you do that without a straight position you must be do the same position of the magnet if uh, 45 degrees 90 degrees depend on the position of the steering so you will have to make the position I will shut it off I forget to switch it off you see it we will see what happened and then the error will be gone you can see only the warning is shown is break okay just break pressure about the steering warning not showed anymore this is the problem of this grader okay this grader okay I hope that everyone will uh, learn about this type of video how to test the steering sensor if you're facing a uh, sensor damage how you can make it exactly exactly that diagnostic system it is right or not broken wire or what if directly sensor damage because you know the sensor is a very expensive parts okay there is a more than 2000 almost 3000 dirhams okay thanks everyone i hope that this video that somebody will be learned again and it is a simple techniques how to testing the sensor okay thanks for watching hope everyone will uh, please subscribe my channel if you think this video is uh, very helpful okay bye bye uh, again again one more time i will remove the magnet and then we will see what will happen i will not shutting off the <coughs> switch ignition switch okay i'm going to remove the magnet we will see what happened now the magnet in, is in my hand we will see what happened okay <laughs> see the steering warning is again showing okay thanks you all uh, thanks everyone uh, please subscribe I hope that uh, everyone will help this video. Thank you again. Well, thank you for watching.